In today's video, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to wirelessly cast your iPhone to any smart TV. Majority of smart TVs have this feature built in now, and it's really easy and also super handy to use. On my phone here, I'm gonna swipe down from the top right-hand corner to open up my action sensor, and then I'm gonna select on the uh, Apple or screen mirroring option. If you don't have this option here on your smartphone or on your iPhone, press in the top left-hand corner, and then we're gonna add a control and then we're just gonna type in screen mirroring and we're gonna add this to our quick control center. And you see I have it here twice now. It is the last option, it's the two squares, but I'm gonna select on that. And then this is gonna look for all the displays that are currently connected to the same Wi-Fi network as my phone. So just make sure your TV and your phone are in the same Wi-Fi network and they're all gonna appear here. I'm gonna now project to the TV behind me, which is the 75 inch Samsung frame by simply selecting on 75 inch the frame or whatever your TV name is. And you'll see that the phone automatically kicks off and it's starting to mirror. It's super handy. I use this quite a bit when I'm doing things like showing people photos. So here is a video that I'm playing for my phone of our recent trip to Korea. Uh, you can use the controls on the phone, the volume up, volume down to control the volume. You can also scrub back and forth on the video, or if you press back, you're just gonna get all your photos here really nice and neat on your on your screen. Uh, of course, if you open up a photo, uh, depending if you have your phone in portrait or landscape mode, uh, but this is a great way of sharing content directly from your phone straight over to the TV. Uh, and I do this quite a bit when sharing things like family photos. Of course, you can get out of this by swiping up. It's gonna share your whole screen anyway. Uh, I'm gonna go over to say my YouTube, for example. I wanna show people my analytics. Depending on the app, um, it may or may not rotate with your phone. The YouTube studio app only shows in the, um, in the portrait mode. My internet's a bit slow at the moment, which is why nothing is loading behind me. But you'll see here that as I jump around, it will start to load. Although if I go rotate, oh, it actually does rotate with us because the app does rotate. I didn't know that. Um, cool. And then if you wanna disconnect, simply swipe down from the top right-hand corner, select on the screen mirroring option that you can see is highlighted in white with the blue screens, and then simply select on stop mirroring. So this is really cool, uh, it's really easy to use, and it's super handy. Another thing I love doing is of course watching YouTube videos, uh, and sometimes you just wanna cast it from your phone straight to the TV. Just gonna pop that on mute. And you can do this straight from the YouTube app. So I'm gonna open up the app here. Uh, and what you see is I've just got my home screen. I'm gonna select on this uh, Huberman clip and before it starts really playing, what you'll see here is that when you pause in the top right hand corner, you get your settings, your captions, then there's a little uh, square with a Wi-Fi symbol. This again is your projection option. So if I select on this, this will again look for all the TVs around me that are on the same Wi-Fi network. I'm gonna send it to the 75 inch frame. Doesn't have to be a Samsung TV. A lot of modern uh, TVs have this feature built in and then it'll start playing. Depending on your TV, my one goes into a picture in picture mode. Uh, but from here, I can go to choose to launch the content. I have it side by side with the TV, but I'm just gonna go maximize for now. You can use either your TV remote to control this or you can actually use your phone to control things like scrubbing through uh, as well as controlling things like the volume as well. Another cool feature is that from your phone, you can actually select on the video. In the top right-hand corner again, press on that Wi-Fi TV symbol, and then you can actually have the option, there's a microphone, there's also a control option. If we select on that control option, this makes it really easy to control things on the screen uh, because it turns your phone into a whole control. Uh, and then once you're done uh, sharing, you can simply swipe up, close the app, turn off your TV, whatever you wanna do, um, really easy. Oh, that actually didn't stop the stream. Of course, demos never uh, never work perfectly. Um, but there you go, it is that easy to wirelessly cast your iPhone to your TV to show things like photos and videos or anything that's on your phone, as well as do things like YouTube videos where you can play and use the whole TV uh, to cast and watch your YouTube. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving me a thumbs up and the super to raise your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching, see you next time.